just want to bring a short guitar lesson. I was listening to the Dixie Hummingbirds and it's a man named Howard Carroll that played and sung for them. And it's a few things that he did that kind of gave me inspiration to do a video for you. Just to kind of show you some of the things that he did to uh, pioneer a lot of the guitar chords and riffs that we do in gospel. So, uh, one song in particular that they did was uh, This World is the Dressing Room. And the intro went something like this. Let's just do a slow one time so you'll catch it. So the chord that I want to show you today is this chord right here. So that's the diminished chord. And basically how you play it, just imagine like you're doing a regular dominant chord. Like, just a regular dominant chord. But what you're going to do, you're going to slide that. You're going to raise the bass note. And you're going to raise it to a diminished chord. The reason that works is because whenever you, basically it's a concept, you can look up Barry Harris' concept in diminished, that whenever you lower a, any note in the diminished, you're going to go to basically a dominant chord. So if this is a diminished, if I lower that one, it's a dominant. Dominant. That's another video, but that's why that works. And as you can see in that intro of what Harold Carroll did, even back in the days, he would take that, raise that up, and he would go down in minor thirds. That's a pretty good chord, man. And uh, how I incorporate it into my playing is just say, I'm just going to stay in E. Um, so. Just something like that. You know, like... something like that even that chord right there it's a chord so I hope you can take that I know it's a short video but Hopefully you could take that and kind of just run with it. I'll be blessed.